Coaching at is with Katie Ross. How are you Hello, doing? Hello, Lee. So great to see you. Thank you so much for inviting us tonight. Thank you for coming. Yeah, I mean, so just, we're at the Quantum... Headquarter like, office in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. This is like NASA, isn't it? It is. It's like either the Academy Awards, NASA, I don't know. <laughs> it's the most immaculate building, it is. factory uh, you, you'll ever see. And it's... It, yeah, it's a, we just had the tour and it is quite quite something to behold. It is. I come from um, Birmingham. Okay. Where Paul and, uh, and, uh, Some and of the John's others. from. Yes. In England and it's called the um, Black Country because that's where the Industrial Revolution in England started. Yes. Filthy. Absolutely filthy. I learned that recently. Yeah? Yes. What, being dirty? Or? Yes. In that area. Okay. Are you, have you from been? John. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. So go on, quickly tell us, what do you do? So I am business development manager here. And so I get involved with marketing, sales support. Um, we're involved, about to launch our new website. How long so have you been working on that? Prior to my involvement here, it was started. So we're really excited, hopefully in the next week. So you're a, new, you're a newbie here. I am a newbie. Yeah, how yeah. Long? Um, If I tell you, I'd have to kill you. No, this is going to be hard getting. <laughs> but I was I was a burger boat company 15 years. I've been at Quantum for really? two months, two and a half months. So go on. How did you get into this industry? So through marriage. Okay. So All right. had been married a year and a half and up in Wisconsin. Up in Wisconsin. That's so, where you're from. No, no I'm a Minnesota. Minnesota. I'm a Minnesota girl. Absolutely. So um, after a year and a half of marriage, David said, you know, I'm frustrated when he had sold his business and wasn't going the direction he wanted. So he said, we got a boat and he kind of, you know, heard about Burger Boat, the plight of it shutting down in 2000, or 1990, 20 minute notice, the company was shut down. And so it kind of tugged at his heart and he said, you know, what do you think of moving there? And I'm like, hmm, really? Downtown Chicago, Manitowoc. Downtown Chicago, Manitowoc. So, away we went to Manitowoc. Good morning. After a year and a half of marriage, and we stayed there for almost 20 years. What did you, your husband bought the boat yard? He reopened it. Wow. Yeah, imagine that. So it was about David Ross. David Ross. So Again, this is... This is what's great about this show. I mean, I should know that name. No, 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 really no. no. So he's name. now with Yatsu here in Fort Lauderdale. Right, okay. And, um, and I'm with Quantum. So what, what was your role at Burger? Marketing. So did that for 15 years. Took a bit of a hiatus, got into custom software development. Custom software, okay. And a restaurant. So hold on, so you're one of these I don't people, recommend the restaurant business if anyone's... So you're one of these rare people who tried to get out of the industry and then it pulled you back in. Back in. <laughs> I know, here I am. So how do they find you? Is this like well, a... David and John are close and it just kind of was a discussion and before you knew it, we were talking and then it just yeah. happened. So Blimey. I started, yeah, so you, the beginning of October. So you're doing business development here. I am. I mean, the company's already seems to be well established. It, it is. So where else you go, where else go, you guys want to so go? So we're really trying to channel the direction. We do want to really grow the military business and commercial business. Um, with is that something? So the stabilizer thing. Yes. Is that something that's on every military boat, or is that something that? It is now. It didn't used to be in the past, but they're recognizing the advantage of people being able to function, do their jobs, not damage the boat, not yeah. damage the people, you know what I mean? So it's really becoming um, much more commonplace than it ever was before. It's, I was speaking to somebody, a Viking, yes. Viking, a small fish, um, two years ago, and they were saying Sea Keeper had just come out with their... Gyro. Gyro. Yes. No, it wasn't two, it must have been like five, six, seven, whatever it was. Yeah. And they're like, you know, in 10 years, 15 years' time, people will be on a boat and it won't rock. And they'll, they'll be like, do you realize in the old days, boats used to rock and people used to get seasick? 
Well, nah, 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 that's not the way it was. Yes. It's, that's the way it's going to be It has eventually. evolved. So in 1999, Quantum was the first to develop the zero speed stabilization. First company. Huh. Their technology. And in 2000, it was put on the very first boat. And that changed the yachting industry. Completely changed the yachting industry. It wasn't perfect at first, and they tweaked it, and they, you know, it was trial and error, and then they got it. And since that happened, it was as though people would be sitting in a marina or at anchor, and they'd see a boat that wasn't rocking, they'd be like, what? What is that? You know? And suddenly it became just absolutely a domino effect where everyone had to have it. So it did... You know, when you think about, do you want to be sick on a boat or do you want to be comfortable? There's no question, really. really. It's just... Absolutely. Yeah, there's no question. Yeah. Well, wonderful. I know you've got to go and give the tour. Yeah, I will. I will give She's the needed. tour. She's needed. She's needed. So, so I am. Well, thank, thank you. you. Thank you so much. Thank you for being on the show. Thank you.